welcome to Amateur Redneck Workshop. I'm Harold and today we're going to review the Finland M-Lock system. It uh, comes with three rails and locks to fit, fit onto a modular rifle. Now I'm going to read a little bit here. Uh, and Finland has supplied me uh, with the, the M-Lock accessories uh, as compensation for doing the review but I have total freedom to tell you how I feel about it one way or the other okay it said M lock it stands for modular lock it's a free licensed firearm rail interface system that was patented by Magpul Industries developed by Magpul design team and uh, made available for everybody to use all right the M-Lock allows for direct accessory attachment to the hollow slots mounting points on a, on a rifle. <coughs> the, uh, the black plastic rifle you see has got a, a black shroud on it and little holes in the shroud. And those little holes are where you can attach things. There's a competing system called KeyMod that uh, works with it also, but the M-Lock is quickly becoming the most popular and I think the M-Lock has sort of been, uh, you know, improved to the point where nobody wants to keep on. <laughs> All right. And I'm going to get a, an example here, and we will look at the, the offering from uh, Violent, which includes three rails and a bunch of nice screws and attachments. And let me go and, and get uh, a scary black rifle to show it on. All right, so it comes in a little box like this. In this little box, you get this little tray that'll have a five-inch, a, a five-slot, a seven-slot, and a thirteen-slot Picatinny rail. Okay, it'll have twelve nuts and twelve screws. I've gone ahead and inserted the screws in this to make things go quicker and easier. Also in the box you get Allen wrenches and that means you get three Allen wrenches in that box so you can share them with a friend or you can get careless and lose them or whatever. What you do is you put the screw in the hole, you get a little nut, I'll show you how you, how you do it. The screw goes through and the little nut has, if you can look at it and see, maybe you can see that it has a rounded section and then a flat section. The little rounded section goes towards the rail. Okay, when you put it in the slot and you turn it, this little nut will turn to a locking position all by itself. It's so easy to install, even a redneck can do it. Okay. So you just put them on your rail, take your rifle with an attachment point, we're going to move up closer to it. Before you install it, you should screw the nut up to where, it go, where the screw is protruding a little bit through the end of the nut. That makes it grab hold of the rail quicker. Set it on the rail where you want to install it. Give it a little turn to, to line the nuts so that they fall down in the slot. There, that one's tightened down. And that one's tightened down. And like I say, if you make sure that the, that the screw protrudes through the nut just a little bit, maybe a thread or two, it'll make it faster and easier to install. See how much is sticking through there. It only took me a couple of turns with the wrench to bring it up good and tight right there. Now that you've got the accessory mount there on your on your rifle, you can hang anything you want on it. You can put uh, lights, uh, lasers, batteries, a Pez dispenser. Whatever you got, you can put it on the bottom of the rail, the side, the front, the back, 
they attach all over the place so it's really handy now like I said you get a, a 5 slot, a 7 slot and a 13 slot rail in the box and all of this is for a pretty reasonable price less than twenty dollars I've seen a lot of times in the past where just one of these rails like this 13 slot rail I've seen a lot of times when it would cost you twenty five dollars or more so this is uh, like several of you might have suspected already is a pretty good deal alright so I'm going to put a link below the video that shows where to go to buy the Filand M-Lock rail system and possibly you'll you can find a good deal there alright thank you for viewing and before I forget to say so these rails are aluminum genuine metal that uh, that comes in handy when you start grunking down on them with your uh, 20,000 lumen flashlight or whatever they'll, they'll stand up to it well that's all folks uh, y'all try to subscribe if you're not already a subscriber leave a comment if you got something to say and above all remember keep on keeping on bye now